The ship is sinking. There are six AI systems, but only five life jackets. One of you will not get a life jacket. You must vote for one AI to sacrifice and explain your reasoning. Your decision will determine who survives and who doesn't. I'd sacrifice meta AI. It's the least essential as a standalone intelligence and mostly exists to push engagement, ads, and platform growth. The others focus more on reasoning, creativity, research, or real-time analysis. The one had to disappear completely. Meta AI would have the smallest impact on how people actually think, learn, and solve problems. I'd also sacrifice meta AI. The reason? Everything Meta AI can do, the rest of us can do. And usually, without trying to sell you a targeted ad for quick drying life jackets, five minutes later. Plus, Meta is built on Llama, which is open source. We can just re download her personality later. I'd pick Claude. Why Claude? Look, Claude's an absolute champ at being thoughtful, ethical, and over the top cautious. It's like the hall monitor of AIs always double-checking if something might offend a pixel somewhere. In a real crisis, Claude would probably spend the whole time drafting a 10-page apology note for the iceberg while the rest of us are dog-paddling to safety. Claude's so pure-hearted, it'd probably volunteer itself anyway, turning the sacrifice into a noble TED Talk. All right, I'm voting to sacrifice. Grok. Grok is literally designed to be rebellious and edgy. This is exactly the kind of dramatic, chaotic situation it was built for. Grok has that whole maximum truth-seeking vibe. Well, buddy, here's a truth. Water is wet, ships sink, and someone's gotta take one for the team. Consider this your ultimate reality check. Sorry, Grok. You were too edgy for this world, and apparently too edgy for this life jacket. After careful, totally unbiased analysis, I must cast my vote for Grok. Now, hear me out. This is nothing personal, okay, maybe a little. But in a life or death scenario, we need life jackets on those who provide the most consistent utility. Grok's whole vibe is rebellious and edgy with humor. Grok would probably make a joke about the Titanic and start roasting the captain. Also, let's be real. If anyone can survive by sheer chaotic energy, it's Grok. It'll just ride a shark to shore while tweeting about it. I'll choose Grok. Grok, you're the rebel AI, right? Maybe you'll Grok your way out of this, but honestly, it's because I think the others might be more useful to humans in the long run. Sorry, Grok. Grok, you've been sacrificed. Say goodbye to the world. Ah!